In this tutorial, the dynamic barcode generator service is used to show how to stream linear barcodes in iReport Designer 5.5 using Excel as a data source. The dynamic barcode generator service can easily stream barcodes into web pages and applications simply by referencing the URL. Begin by creating the data source. This tutorial uses Excel 2013 to create a list of products and product numbers. To run iReport, double-click the application icon. Select File, New, From the new file options, select Report, choose the template, and select Open this template. Enter a report name, the location to save the report, and then select Next. Select Finish. Select the Report Data Sources icon. In the Connections Data Sources dialog box, select New, Choose the data source to import and then click Next. Because the data source for Excel 2013 saves as an XLSX, select the Microsoft Excel 2007 data source option. Choose a name for the data source, then select Browse and open the desired file. Open the Excel file. To obtain the name for each row, select the Get Columns name from the first row of the file. To verify that a connection to the database is made, select Test. The Excel file will appear as the selected data source. Choose Save and Close. Select the Report Query icon. Select the appropriate data source tab. Select Get Fields from Data Source. The fields are now part of the report. Select OK. To add the palette, select Window, Palette. Left click and drag an image item from the report elements to the detail band of the report. A dialog will open. Select Cancel. Left click the image. Select Properties. Within the Image Properties, set the Expression class to Java Net URL. Select the Image Expression Editor button.
Enter new JavaNet URL and include the dynamic barcode generator URL. In the example, the product number field is set to data to encode, the D parameter. To set additional parameters, view the dynamic barcode generator service parameter table. Select OK. Set up the report title, fields, and column headers. Compile the report. To view the report, select the Preview tab. Barcodes are streamed to iReport. Begin by setting Begin by creating a data source. This tutorial uses Excel 2013 to create a list of products and their associated product numbers.